What's going on guys? It's Omniarch and I'm bringing you a brand new video. We're going to be talking about a little story that happened to me today and how that relates to the topic of this video. So I was at the gym this morning, uh, just going through my phone, went to Spotify. I was looking for some new music, you know, stuff that's upbeat and, you know, something like you can work out to, you know, some good workout music. So I click on the viral 50. I guess it's like the top 50 most viral uh, songs in the US right now. And uh, I saw number three was new on the list and it's called it's every day bro by jake paul and team 10 and i didn't know what this was but it sounded just douchey enough to where you know i figured hey it must be good to work out to if it's super fucking douchey it's probably got some you know typical upbeat tempo some sort of hard bass or something and even if it's a trash song at least it'll be you know something i can work out to so i play the song and i'm listening to the lyrics and the beat the beat is decent um but the song <clears throat> the song is fucking garbage i i'm sorry i can't i can't put it in better terms i i can't describe it more specifically i can't be more in depth other than it's vapid garbage it's absolutely terrible and the worst part about it is you know I, I know it had to have been when they came up with the concept for the song they must have been like okay let's make it the most cringy trash that we possibly can and we'll feature a bunch of these uh t i guess team 10 people who have decently large followings on social media uh we'll feature a bunch of them so the video will go and the video the music the song everything it'll go viral but it'll be so fucking bad and so cringy and so embarrassing that millions of people will make reaction videos to it on youtube uh and it'll go even more viral because of that now what's frustrating here is that you know by making a reaction video to it you're feeding the machine um but i really just i i have to talk about how fucking terrible this song is now i'm just gonna play you a little clip of the music video the song or whatever um and you could just just listen to it if you've never heard the song don't don't click off the video don't listen to it for yourself i'll play you a clip of the of the song and i'll save you the time it's just trash okay so let's just listen to the song really quick it's every day bro it's every day bro it's every day bro i said it's every day not only do the lyrics make absolutely no fucking sense they literally make no sense at all everybody in the video looks like a freaking idiot when they're trying to dance around and jump around and you know put on this fake like persona of them being young and rich and successful and it's just so cringy like it's so bad i i really i can't fathom how things like this keep happening like how does our society allow people like this to get seen on the internet? Like, these people should be legitimately embarrassed because they look so fucking stupid in this video. Whoever, like, their management team is or whatever, whatever contracts they have, they're probably not making as much money as they're leading on to believe. Like, they probably just signed a contract and, like, they didn't read it or, or whatever, and they're probably making a lot less money than people think they're making. And because of that, they, they put on this persona like, oh, they're young and rich and, and like successful and super cool and like, oh, you're gonna hate on us because we're so successful and, and all this stuff. And it's just like, it's so overplayed at this point where it's like, you know, they talk about in the video or the song like about like, oh, we made five million views or whatever in 30 days or some shit like that i don't even know they, they talk about like their their internet success and and how it's like super impressive and like how they're like the best right now and all, like they're they're the next they're the next thing they're the next big thing um like they're super popping right now or whatever the fuck and it's like uh, this, this, we've heard this a million fucking times in the last three years from these one and done like artists that aren't even artists honestly like they might have actually wrote this song because the lyrics are so shitty that there's no way they paid someone to do it but there's a chance that they just paid someone to do it uh, and they just did a really crappy job so they're not even artists they're just a bunch of young people who just are trying they're just like like culture puppets 
where they're just being pushed to to the front of the culture and people are just looking at them and they're like uh we better sing and dance and make a music video we're so fucking famous popular rich like you know jacob sartorius was another fucking instance of this where like they pop off they have one or two hit songs like hit songs like they go viral on the internet but they're not actually hits like they're not actually good uh and then they disappear i haven't heard anything from jacob sartorius in a while like it's it's so overplayed like it's like you see right through it they make the song about oh we're so we got so many views and we're so popping on youtube and all this shit and it's like dude everyone with half a brain who's listening knows that this is not a this is not like a sustained thing like you have a spike in your career right now and that's it like you're spiking and then you're gonna go back to being a fucking nobody uh because th the reality is you're not entertaining you're not bringing anything to the table uh there's no content there's no quality there's no talent that's the big thing there's no talent here so you're not actually bringing anything to the table all you're being is a fucking douchebag you're bragging about your current success for whatever re i don't know how you're fucking successful to be completely honest with you um so i don't know how that's happening uh, but it's happening and you're lucky you're in this great position and you drop a music video talking about Oh, I'm the fucking, we're the best kids ever, like, we're the shit, man, like, no, you're not, no, you aren't, and the fact that you're saying that you are makes it even more cringy that everyone in the room knows that you're gonna be a fucking nobody in, like, two years, not even, not even, probably a year, um, so it's just, it's so frustrating to keep seeing this, like, every year, or every six months, we see a new thing, a new super viral, like, younger generation or super viral Instagram model or whatever the fuck, and they're always, like, popping off, but then they don't have any talent or quality or content or anything, uh, and then they go away, and it's like, why waste the limelight on these people who just bring fucking nothing to the table, uh, when there's other people that could be getting this, uh, attention and actually have a career from it, you know, where they actually have years of success instead of just one viral piece of garbage, uh, and I don't know, it's just really frustrating, and I just, I, I wanted to make this video talking about it because it's just so funny to see, like, people like this still coming out of the woodworks and still blowing up out of nowhere for just the most ridiculous shit ever uh and who, who knows maybe i'm just out of touch with like the seven-year-old demographic that jake paul and the team and team 10 um are going for i don't know well, who manages them i think he said something about disney in the beginning of the song maybe he's like a, so affiliated with disney or maybe he used to be on disney channel i don't know i really have no fucking idea where they came from uh, so maybe I'm just like super out of touch with their demographic of 10 year olds. I don't really know. I have no idea. But uh, certainly their demographic is not uh, people with a brain. So they have to at least be below like the age of 16. There's no way that this guy has an army of like young adults. Like there's no fucking way. So uh, I don't know what's going on with this whole thing. But I figured I'd share it with you guys. I want to hear your comments down below. If you know anything more about Jake Paul? Like I really... I have no idea who he is, so I don't know why he's like bragging about how popular and famous he is in the song, because I legitimately, I don't know. He has no talent, so I'm not going to look it up. Like, I really don't give a fuck. Um, so, yeah. I'm not even like salty. I just, I'm just confused, to be completely honest. I don't really understand what's, like, what is happening. Um, and like, why he's acting the way he's acting. I don't, I don't feel like, I don't feel like it's justified. I feel like he just looks like an idiot. But anyway comment down below letting me know what you think of this song have you heard of this song before um if you haven't like i said don't go looking for it don't give them any more ad revenue don't give them any more exposure just just fucking leave it at that i just figured i would talk to you guys about it see if you know anything about it and if you can give me some more information about it drop it down in the comment section below if you enjoyed this video smack a thumbs up on it i would really really appreciate that and if you're new around here you can subscribe to my channel and i would really appreciate it if you turned on notifications that way you would know the next time that I upload. And that's about it, guys. So thank you so much for watching. This has been Omnirk, and I will talk to you guys again soon. Peace.